Stacy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so it's time for a grocery haul. Lighting's kind of weird. It's a sunny day. It's really hot, but I don't know why the lighting's so weird. I'm using natural lighting. Maybe it is a little hazy. I don't know why, though, but it's warm. Today is uh, April 8th, a Monday. I just got done with work, or my first job, at least. I have many jobs in mine. But after work, I always go grocery shopping, and I try to spend under $100, which I did. I only spent $63. And it's so weird. Last time when I spent $141, it's like, it seems like I got more today. It's just weird how that happens. But I didn't need any flea medicine or anything like that. Oh, my God. You are. Of course, I, as soon as I turn the camera on you, you're going to stop. Felix was on his back in a weird yoga pose. He was just, his front back leg was behind his it was Chris he's just swimming around the carpet I know I got a vacuum later so swim all you want get all that loose air because now that it's springtime and getting warmer and getting close to summer everyone's shedding my cats are shedding more my bird is shedding I'm shedding so there's a lot and then now I have the windows open so the wind Brings the sand in, so more vacuuming. Oh, well, just the way it is. Okay, so let me show you what I've got. Let me pull this over here. First things first, I stocked up on my champagne. Because if you buy six bottles of wine or champagne, same thing, you get 30% off. So instead of buying just four all the time, I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to stock up because I'm going to use it eventually anyway. So I got six bottles of my Andre Brut. That's usually $5.99, so $6 each bottle. But then I got 30% off because I got six bottles. Yikes. Six bottles of Champagne, which won't go to waste because now that um, it's getting to be hot in summertime, I'm drinking more of these than the red wine. It's just, it's just the way it is. It's just more refreshing. And now I'm, I'm doing it with the grapefruit juice. It's just changed all that. that I just got to stick with the grapefruit juice for my champagne. It makes a world of difference. I like the grapefruit juice. I always get a bag of salad, whether I need it or not, because uh, the other one probably wilt it, and I use salad in everything. I throw it in everything. Seriously, whatever I'm making, I'll just throw a handful of less in it. It, it. it makes it go longer, like it stretches it out, make it a, the meal bigger. Plus, I actually like the crunch in it. Okay, speaking of wine, I did get another bottle of the red, because uh, this is like equivalent to two bottles of red, and I like this is my new thing instead of the bottles for now, which is fine with me. The bottles are good when I go somewhere and I take a bottle with me. That's, that's the good thing. Um, I didn't really need this, but, um, I'm kind of running out of chocolate a little bit. I do have some chocolate bark. I have a lot of chocolate bark, but I haven't been in the mood for it. But I have, like, little things of chocolate. And lately, at the end of the night, I kind of feel like having, like, a little dessert. And that little chocolate kind of goes all the way. And I know my roommate kind of likes it, too. So I'm kind of running out. Not really running out, but kind of. And so... Anyway, they have Easter candy on sale. It's kind of Easter, but not really. These are Oreos chocolate candy bars. These are pretty good. And they're individually wrapped, and uh, they last me a long time. And between me and him, we snack on them. This will last me quite a long time. Like, seriously. I only buy candy, like, every so often, like, during the season, like, Easter, and maybe summer. I don't know. I don't know. But every once in a while, it's good to have on hand. I got more grapefruit juice. I love it. The ruby red 100% grapefruit pulp free. Although I like the pulp. I don't mind the pulp. But uh, I'll put that here for now. And then I went ahead. It wasn't really on sale. It was on sale for $3.49. But I'm getting sick of just like there's no. I, there's a lot of creamers. But they're just there's not different ones. I always like to trade for ones. But I, I'm, I'm going to go to my. my um, this is what I go to. This is my OG. This is my Cinnabon, which is the favorite one. So I went ahead and did it, even though it's not really on a sale that I like. Okay, I got a lot of these. I've been in the mood for macaroni and cheese. I should probably tell you, I'm going to do a vlog, but you've probably already seen it. I went to the Playboy Mansion reunion. We had a reunion. Um, 
and it was like a potluck, and everyone brought stuff. And someone brought some mac and cheese, and it was so good. And so, so good that uh, when I ate some, when I came home, I made more. <laughs> I've been bad. I need to work out. I don't, I'm like, oh God, I don't know if I'm gaining weight or not. Cause I never weighed myself. I haven't weighed myself in over 10 years, probably 12 years, but I could feel it. Like I need to work out, but I don't care. I'm gonna, I care, but I don't care. So I bought these. These are a dollar each. And I thought, you know what? I'm just going to stock up on these. Cause whenever I feel like something different, this is tomato, basil, garlic, pasta. That looks good, right? That way I don't have to make a big pot of pasta and then feel like I have to eat it, like open whole can stuff. It's just a couple servings, so that's good. That would be good with salad. And then I got some teriyaki noodles when I feel like uh, having Asian food, like it's a lo mein. I don't know what I'm hearing. It sounds like a horn, but not really. But I thought this would come in hand handy on, on habit. And this is cheddar broccoli. <laughs> That'll be good with actually chopped up broccoli, which I have. I have some leftover chopped up broccoli that I use for, that I give my bird. Uh, and then I got, these are good. These are just garlic creamy shells. I just put a dollar each. I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to stock up on these because when I don't know what to have and I want a salad, but I want something to go with a salad, these are perfect. And I could throw a can of peas in it. I could throw, um, I could throw any canned vegetables, spinach, I could throw anything in there. Okay, I'm going to save this right now. I've been craving cottage cheese lately. I do like cottage cheese, and it's good for uh, protein. Um, and, like, I could put, like, sauce in it. I could use it as a dip. I put it on toast. Sometimes I make um, uh, enchiladas out of it. I get the corn tortilla, and I mix this up with some taco seasoning, and I roll them up, and then I put the enchilada sauce on top, and then I make, like, vegetarian enchiladas. Cheesy enchiladas are pretty good. Got more paper towel, of course, like the size. This is staple. I didn't know why I needed it, but I got it anyway. And I've been liking tomatoes. Sometimes I'll just po poke a, a tomato in my mouth. If I'm having cheese and I feel like a little guilty because I'm eating cheese, I'll eat it with a tomato because it cuts down the, the cheesiness. And it maybe makes it almost like I'm eating pizza because I put some seasoning on it. But I love tomatoes, so I got more tomatoes. I got more. To I got him more toilet paper. I don't know if he needed some or not, but I grabbed it anyway. Seventy-seven cents, not a big deal. And this is for at work. If I feel like I, I this is also like um, if I want with the cottage cheese, I always this I stock up on on salsa. You never know when you need it, and you never want to run out of salsa. So I got that. Oh, and we needed some more dishwashing soap. This is only ninety-seven cents. It's orange. Just washing soap. And then this was in the manager section, 99 cents. Just a uh, normal toothpaste, so I got it. Why not? 99 cents. Sparkling white. I'm like, all right. I like to stock up. I don't ever want to run out of that. And then I got some more renews it because it down the hall, uh, instead of candles now, I've been using these and they work out pretty good. They last me for like a week. Like I, I. When I open them, I open, I open them all the way up. Actually, it lasts me about two weeks. I could get two weeks out of these. But uh, these are just uh, plumera, coconut, and pineapple. I like those the best. So I got that. And this was a splurge buy. This was $4.99. But I just like campers. I don't have one. I have no place to put it. But I would just love to own like a little camper one of these days. But I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. I, I don't have time to go camping. I've been really busy. My animals probably wouldn't like it. They like me home. I like being home. You know, I pay so much rent that I get, I try to get my money's worth. But whenever I, I can, I stay home. But it's I, I like I like the look of campers. They just they're just one of my little guilty pleasures from when I was a kid. I just like campers and where you home is where you roam. So I just got a dish towel. I didn't need it. I just liked the decor. I just liked it. Oh, yeah, here's my water. I've been drinking lots of water lately. Oh, there's... Oh, yeah. Now, I have bread, but this was in the manager section. And I haven't got bagels in a long time. And I know he likes bagels, so it's like... So once in a while, when I, I feel like I just want to have it, I don't have to worry about it going to waste, because I'm pretty sure he'll, he likes bagels. 
And this is multi-seed bagels, so they looked really good and semi-healthy. It was on sale for $1.29. I'm like, okay, I'll get some bagels. But if I get bagels, I gotta get cream cheese. And usually I get the cheap cre cream cheese, like the, the, the condensed one. This is still cheap. This was $1.99, but this is whipped. And I like whipped, and I but I, would, I never want to pay for like uh, like air. But the, Dr. Oz was saying whipped is better because you use less of it, and it's just as tasty as using the condensed cream cheese. And so I don't know. And plus it tastes better. So I'm like, what the hell? I'm gonna get whipped cream cheese to go for the with the bagels. Something odd. Just kind of throw that in there because it was on sale. Okay, now these, for the barbecue, for, or uh, the, uh, the Playboy Mansion reunion, we all brought stuff. I brought chips, so all my chips that I had, I took them there, and I took some uh, uh, a bottle of sangria. I probably really didn't need to bring anything, because they had so much stuff. They had so much stuff, so I'm sure whoever, like, I think Kia put it in charge. I think uh, she took had to take a lot home. Uh, I was worried about that because last year, same thing. I brought stuff and it was like so much stuff. But um, anyway, it's nice to contribute anyway. There was one guy that liked my sangria. But the chips, there was enough chips. But since I got rid of all my chips, I'm like, okay, well, I need to stock up now. But I don't really eat that many chips because we have chips at work. So I'm hungry. I'll get that. But these were, you know how ladies have those weird flavors every once in a while? So I got this. This is kettle cooked beer and cheese you know I'm gonna like that right beer and cheese that looks really good kettle kettle chips so I got that and then I got this which I don't know I just got them because they're new this is lime and sea salt that seems kind of normal I don't know but like I said if I don't need them like I keep chips on hand for stuff like that when I when there's like a party or something and I bring it along so it's nice to have something different you know this is Flaming Hot Dill Pickle. This kind of looks good. So I stocked up on chips. This is $63. That's pretty good, right? I did really good. I got a lot of stuff. I got a lot of stuff I really didn't, I really didn't need to get the bagels and the, this. I, this is like, in fact, the tomatoes would go with, good with this. Sometimes I like to dice up tomatoes and put it on top. And then I sometimes I toast it even more. Or you could do the, I could do the um, cottage cheese. Oh, yeah. I'm not hungry right now, so it's like I, I was going to put everything away because I'm just not hungry. Like, literally, yesterday at the, at the Playboy Mansion uh, reunion, um, I hit, I just I just picked at everything that they had. It was, like, so good. They, had, they brought French fries. I know they brought French fries and mac and cheese and chips. They just, I just made a plate of just a bunch of bad food, but it was awesome. And then when I came home, I was still craving it, so I, I, I had some leftover pasta, and I, I melted some cheese on it, and then I had some chocolate. <laughs> I've been bad lately, but it's okay. Today's Monday, back to working out, back to the grind. You know, that's what weekends are for, right? To just ruin your whole week's worth of dieting, or I don't really diet, but, you know, a whole week of being good. All right, well, I'm going to put all this away. I'm a little tired. It's been... I gotta sit down and do a vlog of what happened this weekend, and you'll probably see it before you see this, because I'll post this up next Monday. But I gotta sit down and um, and show you what I did this weekend, and show you why I'm tired. <laughs> all right, to all my space cadets, Umber cats, I hope you have a great day. Until next time.